Shelly and Fraser Price, they need to be afraid. Plus, Sharika Jackson, what a thing. Rochelle Clayton, where is she off to? And more honors for Alison Felix. Welcome back to the channel, people. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, thank you for making it Peter Lloyd World. Go ahead, please hit the subscribe button so we can continue to grow. When you do that, go ahead and hit the notification bell so you know when the next video drops, we drop a video at least once a day here on Peter Lloyd World. Also, if you enjoy the content, please hit that like button and finally leave your thoughts. When you're ready, yep, good to go. Once more into the breach, people. Once more, we have a multi-storied video for you, giving you the updates on the top athletes out of jamaica first up rochelle clayton the 400 meter hurdles phenomenon remarkable talent i really think she's going to do well in 2023 started to post these to her instagram account and i'm trying to figure out where is she going to um clearly is she going well is she going to do a meet and or what you tell me now, with her nine-hour flight, she must be going to Europe and she's landed in Munich. Is she going for a meet? Let me know. Then, of course, Brittany Anderson, the silver medalist from the World Athletic Championships, um, hurdles 100-meter star and national record holder. Share these on her Instagram as well as her working on her starts with her team. You know, starting in a sprint race where its hurdles are flat 100 or 200 is a really important thing. Watch. As I stated, sprints are very technical, starts are really, really important. And I really enjoy when, and I hope you all do, when athletes share bits of your training camp. Here she is, Brittany Anderson. Always has a solid start. Now, what's up with Alison Felix? Alison Felix was recently honored in the United States. You all know that she is a 200 meter, 100 meter, and 400 meter phenom, a beast who has been in the game for a very long time. One of the greatest all time athlete sprinter flat sprinter ever um regardless of whether or not she represents the united states of america i think we all agree that we all love alice felix so she posted this to her instagram page i am honored to officially be a part of the incredible legacy of at aka sorority 1908 happy founders day Soror sorors i hope that's the correct pronunciation now, just in case you are unaware, the Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated, aka an international service organize, organization, was founded on the campus of the Howard University in Washington, D.C. in 1908. It is the oldest Greek-lettered organization established by African-American women, college-educated women. This is Alison Felix with the great Patti LaBelle, one of my favorite artists all time. Um, to our honorary welcome members. Now, the sorority posted, thank you for the honor of and recognition of our 115th founder, the President Joe Biden. And Mr. Biden gave a short speech um, ded uh, dedicated to the sorority. Happy Founders Day to them, Alpha Kappa Alpha. You know, uh, more than 100 years we've been employing that motto by culture and by merit. That's made us a better America. Trust me, I know. With my Vice President Kamala Harris and my Director of Office of Management Budget, Shalanda Young, I see it. That's why Kamala and I have made sure to create a real and lasting collaboration with the Divine Nine for the first time in any White House. So thank you, thank you all, and thanks from all of us. Even the great Cosby mom, Felicia Rashad, shared a message. Happy Founders Day, Soros. Happy Founders Day. One of the two celebration today. Now, we're always excited when athletes who deserve it are rewarded and respected and revered. 
certainly Alison Felix is one of the greatest who's ever done it. Uh, this young lady is certainly evolving into one of the greatest who has ever done it. The remarkable Sharika Jackson yesterday um, shared with us that she is now the proud ambassador for water. And uh, persons asked us to give, a, give them some additional information. So here we go. Sharika Jackson shared to her social media pages, It's with great gratitude and humility I share this with you all as the new brand ambassador for at official water at Wisinko to a sprint to a sprinter in the right direction no greater way to kickstart 2023 cheers to a new journey it was an exciting retro vibe so I guess she was at um, the retro party many of you are asking me where it was and I couldn't tell her I never know which party so she shared um, these uh, so full joy Ladies and gentlemen, we have the Tanania, we have Sharika Jackson and Katisha Chapman. Destiny's Child. That is it. <laughs> TC, give me a tour, give me something, say something to the camera. Thank you so much. Tanania, am I saying it right? Tanania, can you say something? Beautiful, gorgeous. Sharika Jackson, one dollar. Sharika Jackson, one dollar. This. I tell the people, I, I cannot wait to be Sharika Jackson. She does have a vibration. Now, the great one, the goat Shelly and Fraser Price, which is the reason why you clicked on this video, I'm certain. Earlier in the month, Shelly and Fraser Price was named the CNW Female of the Year for 2022. They posted truly a splendid season and one which will live long in the memory. The danger of her, the danger to her rivals, she plans on carrying on and even to attempt the world record of 10.49 seconds. And then they wrote, they, meaning the, her rivals, should be afraid, very afraid. And we just thought this was so fitting. Now, many of you may or may not be aware of this list. Now, running 6.98 seconds at her very first 60 meter 
IAAF World Indoor Championships in SOPOT support, I guess. Um, Shelly Ann Fraser Price also became the first woman in history to win an IAAF World title in the 60 meter, 100 meter, 200 meter, and the 4 by 100 meter. Look, people, there's a reason why we reference her as a GOAT because she's a GOAT. Uh, her accomplishments are unequal the only thing she hasn't done yet is break the official world record and there's a high possibility if you run seven sub 10.7s you are a danger to the world record we have to be very very honest the 2023 season 2023 season is going to be an amazing season in track and field particularly amongst the women so yes shelly and fraser price's rivals should be afraid very afraid now we hope you enjoyed this multifaceted um story these stories don't forget to hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell and hit that like button remember you are royals kings and queens bless up